Welcome to the metagame with Oni Black Mage. We're continuing Arkham City, this time with the Steel Mill, located deep inside the Industrial District. The entrance I'm coming from is the one not from the entrance over to the front or the one where the roof exploded later in the game. This is from the back, where normally there are armed guards. But anyway, as soon as you enter, right over to your left you're going to notice this shelf in which you can enter. I believe you have to blow up the wall, I don't recall but there's a roller trophy right behind it. You'll notice that there are various uh, Harley statues that you can uh, you know, destroy with the REC, and they stand out pretty obviously, so finding all of them, which is also contributing to the Riddler score, is really not that difficult. The next one is right across the way before the whole sluice, so just go ahead and use your bat line, jump over, and collect the Riddler trophy, but not before, of course, decrypting it. In this section, it really helps to have a firearm detonator, or you know, disruptor, because just about everybody here in Industrial District carries firearms. So we're ready to go ahead and start you know, walking our way down the sluice, so make sure you pull out your freeze grenade and create your little ice raft there. First part is just pretty boring, just go ahead and just duck underneath here. Yeah, take that hook. Nothing interesting over here, so just keep on pulling over. Up and over. Note that this is actually a one-way trip, so when you get ready to exit the steel mill, you can't come back this way via the sluice. Uh, the way you exit, which I'll show you later on, is actually via the either the exploded roof or story plot. Go ahead and backclaw your way up. You're going to notice the uh, question mark over on the opposite side, but before that, just go ahead and duck underneath this little vent. You'll notice it pretty much right as soon as you exit. Go ahead and hit it with anything, it doesn't really matter. So I just quick battering there. You can get your line launcher out, or you can back claw your way back up from an ice raft if you were to make it. But if you have the line launcher, just go ahead and just use that now. Make sure to angle it properly so that way you don't hit the corner early. There's a grate that you can pull off. And tucked underneath, right here in this little alcove here. The only one really here along this sluiceway is a Riddler Trophy. Nothing else here, so go ahead and either you can uh, bat line your way across or you know create a freeze grenade raft like I'm doing here. Doesn't really matter, just get to the opposite side. You can either jump through the window over there or you can enter similar to how you enter it and do the story, which is just gliding your way down. There may or may not be uh, villains down there. So keep that in mind. As soon as you enter in, you're going to notice this illuminated poster for Boyle Cryogenics. Go ahead and take a snapshot of that. That's one riddle. Another Harley trophy there. Alright, now we're in the cooling tunnel. In this area, it may seem one way, but actually it loops around, so no worries. After we pass another Harley statue, go ahead and walk over, create a freeze blast wrath, as if you were going down the sluice way already, but we're not. Jump on quickly, then turn around. You'll notice that there's part of a question mark that you're going to need to line up on the go. Just time it, snapshot, and before you leave, look up. There's a gap in the roof. Go ahead and back claw your way up, and there's a not too uh, easy to find little where the trophy there. A lot of people can actually miss this because it's uh, kind of in a blind spot where this little uh, ceiling part is tucked away. Nothing interesting over there, so we can just go ahead and enter back into the cooling way. Right? 
Alright, this one will take a little bit of uh, piloting skills. What we need to do is activate another uh, deactivated uh, switch box, but we need electricity. The electricity is way over here down this flight path, all the way down the sluice way over here. You probably notice it on your first way over. This will stretch the limits of the, uh, the time limit on the remote battering, so make sure you get as close as possible, make the trip as brief as possible, and U-turn as fast as possible. Make sure not to hit Batman so he catches it on the way back. Open this little uh, boiler burning room, guide it around, and hit the switch box, which opens up the door and gives you your Riddler trophy. Probably the most complicated flight path you probably have to do so far. But fortunately, we're done with that right now. Go ahead and jump down and get your back claw at the ready. Not just for the obvious uh, pulling across, but as you duck underneath here, get your back claw out and look up. You're going to notice one hanging upside down. Make sure to grab this before you hit the wall of blades. Yank yourself back. You can fight against the uh, the current. It just uh, occurs a little slower, as you can expect. Gotta give uh, credit to Mr. Frizo. It's that's a very sturdy block of ice. They also seem to last forever, or at least you toss until you toss a second freeze blast grenade. So like you would normally, just go ahead and hop up, get your bat line out, bridge the gap. Freeze blast these steam vents, no big deal. That's the electricity that we got earlier. Little marker there, to make sure we're on the right track. You can just go ahead and create a platform for you to jump up on over. Alright, get the freeze blast grenade ready, create another raft, and this time, once again, get your back claw at the ready. Look up and to your right, against the wall you're going to notice the uh, event that you can pull down. That's a little Catwoman trophy that we're tagging for later. It's right around the corner here, past the electricity. Make sure to grab that, yank it down. And pull yourself up. Waiting for you right there is a Riddle Trophy. To get back down, there is a breakable wall that you can go ahead and just uh, destroy. This sets you right back on the path of the sluice way. You can obviously see that I've already progressed the story to the point where I already lowered the bridge, so getting to the next area, I'm just going to go ahead and shortcut through. Otherwise, you'd have to progress per the story. But I'm right here where the minecart is. Now, this is actually something I did during the story, so there's no riddle trophy there. But normally, after you already see that motor and pull that minecart, there is a riddle there, which I'm going to go ahead and give credit for because I collected it during the story. But right next to it, next to a Harley statue, is her mallet. So go ahead and snap a picture of that for the next riddle. Alright, so over here in this cooling chamber, we're just going to go ahead and just attack them directly. Glide forward, off and to the left, opposite of another Harley uh, statuette, which you can notice marked on the map as a breakable object, is a wall that we're going to go ahead and destroy. At least to this open area. It may seem like a dead end. This is actually a good place to go ahead and uh, attack the usual armed combatants that are in there, but if you walk across this conveyor way, you're going to notice a riddle trophy right there, tucked up among the ceiling. This is normally the office where the uh, prisoner hostage is captured, next to another Harley statue. In the dead center, where you notice all the, uh, I don't know what that machine is called, but uh, 
right there in the conveyor belt you notice there's a riddler trophy you can just go ahead get a good view of it and just snag it with your back claw turn around get up to the platform and in front of you there's normally that's a valve that's closed normally you have to pull that open but right behind that is a riddler trophy keep on walking around the into the office there and you're noticing uh, pictures of the Joker but more importantly this diploma for Harley Quinn zoom in and snapshot that that's your next riddle we are ready to leave first we're going to take the side entrance the one that's open through the REC REC open that door And you'll notice the twins that you fought earlier, the hammer and sickle Russian twins. Zoom in on them and take a snapshot. They're the next riddle. But we're not done yet with this room. Climb above them, you'll see a vent. Jumps down, turn around over to your right from where you just exited, and there is a wall that we're going to detonate. Bam! Riddle Trophy. Alright, drop down. Continue forward, you're going to pass another Harley statue. But, uh, we're going to go through the broken door that never opens. Over to this area that has these little, uh, bumper carts next to an REC engine. To clear the room, normally there's also a guy there, but you can also use this to remove the guy, is get around to the other side, hit that motor with the REC, and you see all the bumper cars smashed together like that. Once magnetized, they're gonna open up a couple of entryways. The first one is one that has vents on it that we're gonna go ahead, cap, slide under, and we're going to go ahead and snag this riddle trophy. We're going to go ahead and pause here in the assembly line room, and we will pick this up next time. Just about halfway through. Alright, thanks for watching the metagame with me, Oni Black Mage. Uh, go ahead and uh, keep on watching if you enjoy what you're watching, but uh, thanks for watching and good gaming.